Another type of fact tables is accumulating snapshot facts. This kind of tables are suitable for cases where you want to track where you want to track a process end to end and the monitor the change of the process or process status step by step. For example, in this table here we have a complaints fact table. In this table we have complaint ID, which is a unique ID for this complaint, assigned employee ID, start date. And we have set of columns representing the status or different stages for a complaint process. For example, first status is zero, which means this complaint request has been issued. If this complaint process it changed it from a start stage to investigating stage, so in the same fact table and in the same record and in the same record, we will update the status for this complaint and we will update record. So in the same record, we are updating the same process and keep changing with the last updated status. So now let's say complaint process moved from investigation stage to resolution stage. In this case, status got updated from status number one to status number two, and the resolution date has now updated. Instead of null values or instead of no values, now we have date of when this process exactly entered the resolution state. The final state is review state. Now we can see status has updated to status number three and the review date now has a value of 5th of August 2019. So accumulating snapshot facts is well fit for any use case or any business process or any business use case that required monitoring and updating a certain process with all the stages for this process. So green here, one record in this fact table or in this type of fact table represent one process and all its updates. There are many examples for this fact table. For example, you could have a fact table for employee onboarding where you go with the employee on different stages. So you could have the same example. You could, for example, have employee ID, you could have status, and you could have dates for each status. 